This is a detailed demonstration on how to make a heart-shaped pom-pom. The pom-pom maker, as you'll notice, has ridges on the outside edges. It also has a base. You want to make sure that the arms are even. Also, the heart design on the center needs to be up and down facing you on both sides. The arms open out together, one side goes up and the other side downward. We're going to be wrapping the yarn from the top of the arm to the bottom top to bottom on both sides. Open both arms together. Make sure that they're even. And begin wrapping your arm from the top. You want to use a nice even wrapping and you'll be filling these sections between the ridges full enough that you will not be able to see the ridges. Again, we're wrapping evenly, filling the sections, no ridges in sight. Once one side is wrapped, you'll close it down and open up the other side. Make sure those arms are even and we're going to start, start again from the top. We wrap in exactly the same manner, evenly and full, so that you don't see the ridges between the sections. Close the arm. Now using a strong string such as a kite string, this will be used to hold your pom-pom together. Run the string through the center of the pom-pom maker between the notches. And we're going to do that twice. Bring your string up to the top center of the maker. And we're not going to knot this, but we're going to loop our string twice and then pull down nice and tight. A firm tug on that will hold everything together. The ends of the kite string are wrapped around the hooks on the outside edge of the maker. And we have one on both sides. This holds your center string so that everything is together while you're working on cutting your, your yarn apart. You'll notice that there's um, ditches on four sections of the pom-pom maker and we're going to be cutting through those ditches. You want to make sure that you get every strand of yarn cut. Any strands left will make it so that the pom-pom maker will not release off. Remember, there's four sections, two on each side. Using a pair of scissors and angling them vertically, we're going to cut the excess yarn on the inside of the pom-pom. This helps create the heart shape.
And remember we have four sections to trim. Two on one side and two on the other. We're now going to remove the kite string, so unwrap it from the hooks on both sides. And here's where you want to give it a really firm pull. As you're pulling on these strings, you'll notice that the pom-pom maker will separate slightly. This is okay. Open one arm and then the other arm on one side and remove the pom-pom maker. You'll do exactly the same thing on the opposite side. With the pom-pom maker off, we can now give this a final tight tug. We'll also do our two loop wrapping again for the final part of our knot. Now to make a very distinguished looking heart, we're going to take our thumbs and press at the center portion of the pom-pom. And with our scissors we're going to cut into that dent. After we've created a nice heart shape, we're going to take our scissors and trim all the little pieces that might be straggling. This actually makes the heart very compact and even. Now that's a beautiful heart. Remember creativity. You can always decorate with buttons and beads.